G'day guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Now today I thought I would start a debate about what AFL video game is the best. So I have gone through and put every AFL video game into a list, into old uh, tiermaker.com and I'm going to go through and decide what AFL video game that I have played is the best one. Let me know down below if you would have done any of these uh, different and uh, yeah, let's not mess about, let's get into it. Alright, here we go. So there's a few I don't know of. I had to get on the Google and um, Google a few of these to be perfectly honest with you. Probably the AFL games that I played the most was um, your yeah, AFL 05, 06, 07. We'll get to those in a bit. There was a game that I saw that was uh, Kevin Sheedy's AFL coaching, which appears to be a bit like a, um, a football manager where all you do is be the coach. Didn't get to play that one. So I'm gonna chuck it in the C uh, file. I didn't get to play AFL 98, which was EA Sports. Jeez, if EA Sports could make one um, nowadays, that would be unreal. I don't know where to chuck the ones that I haven't played before. I'm going to chuck them in the C's for now. AFL Challenge on the PlayStation Portable. I can only assume was a D. Let me know down below if you played it. <laughs> and let me know what you thought. Alright, my favourite AFL game ever would have to be AFL Premiership 2007. Um, I used to play as Byron Pickett, David Neitz, Brad Miller, <laughs> Jeffy White. And... Um, I absolutely love that game, so AFL 07 would probably be one of my favourites. 2005 was good, it was serviceable. I thought 2006 was not bad as well. AFL 2003 I can only assume was in the 2005-2004 bracket, where they were good, but not great. I actually get the feeling a lot of people are going to say 2004 should be higher. I played it a little bit, but me, 05s, 06s, 07s were the ones that I played a lot. Yeah, don't know what to do with them at this stage. All right, bit of controversy. What do I do with the new, the newbies? AFL Live 2 is probably the worst game I have ever played, ever. <laughs> there was so much potential after AFL Live 1 that when AFL Live 2 came out, I was absolutely gutted. I would put AFL Live, the 2011 one, almost up the top. I reckon it's that good. The gameplay itself was as good as it gets. I might put it second just for now. Now, AFL Evolution, which I play a lot on my channel. Where does that go? I don't think it's as good as AFL 2007, Premiership 2007. But I don't think, I think it's better than 2005. So I'm going to be putting AFL Evolution second best, which could cause some controversy. But I rate it. I reckon the gameplay is pretty good. The marking needs some work and the kicking a little bit, but end-to-end -end handballing with AFL Evolution is as good as AFL Live. But the career modes and the, um, the bonus gameplay and stuff you get to do in 2006 and 7 is probably better than AFL Live and Evolution. What do I do with these ones? Yeah, Aussie Rules Footy. Um, that's a pisser. Imagine playing that. That actually looks good. I'm going to bump that up a bit. I'm going to bump that up a few. Aussie Rules Footy can go probably in the B. I reckon <sighs> AFL 2004 probably should be higher. AFL Challenge can stay down there with AFL Live 2. <laughs> 98. I wish I played these. What, what did AFL 98 look like? That is a pisser. That is unreal. I get the feeling people are going to tell me to drop AFL Evolution, but... I do enjoy it. I do reckon it is good, so I'm going to leave it there. AFL Live could have been higher if it had career mode. You could play one season and that was it. I, I used to love playing AFL 2007. I played about 10 seasons. The team list was unrecognisable by the time I finished my 10 seasons. The potential AFL Live had with the gameplay was right up there. They just didn't quite deliver. 2005 I did play a lot of. <laughs> 2005 when you'd go for the set shot and the arrow would... <laughs> the, 
The arrow, you'd have to point the arrow. Uh, that's classic, that's good times. Yeah, AFL Live 2, probably the worst AFL game ever. And then I can only assume the PlayStation Portable version of AFL Challenge is as bad. So that's why they're down the bottom. But yeah, I reckon that's it. I reckon that's it for my list. AFL 07, the, the pick of the bunch for mine. But I assume some of the people who played, um, you know, a lot of the ones in the C category might have a different opinion. Once again, guys, I appreciate you watching the channel. I appreciate all the support that we've been getting on the last few videos as well. Um, you know, there's a lot more eyes on the channel than there used to be, and it's so much fun to um, deliver content for you guys. Appreciate all the support. Thanks for spreading the, the message and, and getting the channel's name out there. And um, yeah, go the days on Queen's birthday. Cheers, guys.